So what's up guys? Uh welcome back. This is your boy the Adam Slink and my guy Ima. Welcome again. Uh this is another video. And, uh, we're gonna be making more and more and more and more. Hmm? So firstly, I want to make this clear. Someone wrote something to me, and uh I just want to read it out. According to this guy, he said there is nothing like any family having clean old money. You know that time they just say, ah, that man a old money. You no, know, you, you you don't hear that kind yeah, of statement yeah. with that one yeah. old man. Me that family they get old money. They say old money. That means the money may need. You don't tell me they make that money for grant. They say dig deep. Most old money families at one time had someone who did shady illegal activities or had access to government contracts and made money of the proceed and made money of the proceed so is there any like you know about any hood money any hood family may they actually make money like clean money yeah like when i was still little then we are coming up so in my village, coming to say, they are rich men there. But this week, who will not know, get ties to the government? Yeah, they don't get ties. I'm coming. But then we all believe that these people are money people. Now money, now. Yes, that's what we believe because we don't believe that an individual can have such money as of them. Mm -hmm. So we all believe. But as time goes on, it was better. Proof, yes, yes, these people are really Ogoni people because they, number one, they die early. Number two, the family after their death shattered, those words like as if it vanished. So, I like, I agree with the post. I totally agree with the post. You know, hold money, make clean for there. Yes. There is no hold money that is clean. Yes, I, uh, I, I agree to that. Well, if you, if you, if you, Talk about their like uh, their little dark with the money, local. like their dark attack. A little dark with the family. May they started their trade for uh, exporting granite okay. uh, and all those things. You call. Well, 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 we say we are advancing both in technology and everything. So that's it, yeah. the same thing. That's it. <laughs> no, you know, they, then they are, you know, they say, they only have a work. you know, say, even no, no. exporting those granites, we are based on government approval. Yes, yes, I agree. Uh, based on government mm. approval. That is why up to today, the Sena Dan Gute be the richest man of the Africa. And then if you check, they ask you who they hate, who they support Dan Gute. Nah, coming to Dan Gute matter. Dan Gute is in government. He gets the support of every president. Like most of the presidents that have been there, he work hand in hand with them. I don't know if they even collaborate in his business. So that would they get the support from the government direct. That's why if you watch every uh, electronic period, that would always support a particular person. No, I'm not sure person. whether that would support a particular yes. person. Yes, you see that would they donate. You know what so, I mean? They donate. They uh -huh. donate secrets to all of them. Why you donate? That means you're supporting the person. So you, are, you know how to play the game. You know how to play the game to get what he wants. So in return, these people turn back to support him. If you watch... Oh, uh, let me let me come with Dangote cement and the other factory cement. There. Dangote is the one still trading to today. Other ones were seen as if it was banned. I don't want mm. to use the word it was as if it was banned. And Dangote one was paved way. Everybody Dangote, Dangote. So this had he made his way, and this how he made his money to. The no, be, okay. You see, no, no, see, you know, at that time, eh, when I small, they tell us one story that. That would be the my principal. Nobody ever forget my principal. He lied to us. <laughs> he lied. He lied too much. He said then that would be the look through window. They attend class where people they go class. You know, get money to go class. In the look through window, they attend class. Those are primary school. Those government parents school. They get it. So that would go just the look through window. They write. They attend class through there. Say, don't get money to pay school fees. I don't put up with school oh, hey. I don't believe this. Now, later on, eh, now I <laughs> know, say, Dan Gote family. Uh, Father was the richest man in Nigeria. Eh? Mm. 
So the the eh, heredity that that had them now they are still their cousin. You know, everybody trying to get out. That, ah, that also say car. This people the, that that happens, but I, I think he's actually trying to motivate people. To motivate us by lying, no, no matter the yeah. background. Uh, motivate us by lying. Off, still drag off. I think. Mm -hmm. Motivate us by lying, and again, and, and, that again. Was good, uh, and again. Oh, there's something I want to talk about. Those Igbo men. Okay. Mm, you no, know, say there's this general belief say there are some Igbo men make their money past that with it. Not true. That I can't really say, but I know they are they are like billionaires. In dollars, in dollars, who don't even show themselves. But when you see some boy, someone that have money, like you, like you, a, you, like a Tinubu. Ah, Tinubu. In fact, I will say Tinubu is the richest. If you ask me, <laughs> Tinubu is the richest. But a uh, richer politician, even in business, I think they would. Ah, the case of people for the ability, the case of people like uh, for this country, they know like that. That that's it. They know they would know how how money made up again. Some people don't like maybe coming public or showing themselves. They are like like that. Check this uh, this statement. Say South Africa billionaire Joha Rubert dethrones Alikun Dagote as the continent wealthiest man in a list released by Forbes magazine. That means Dagote is not the richest now for Africa. Yeah, Maybe the second richest. Okay. And they said that South Africa get the most billionaires. Okay. Dangote been dethroned by South Africa. I think I will say Nigeria have happened to him. So this is uh, <laughs> <laughs> this is not going to be a interesting day. because no one surviving. Hey. Environment matters. Your business is like in good and good environment. That is, if you are if you are target audience, maybe are poor or no longer patronizing, the demand is not that much. It's like it could affect you. And your business as well. So I think that's the issue that with it happening at the moment. So let's check and check this out. Uh, let's go to celebrities matter and uh, there is this fact. According to Africa Fact Zone, they released a statement recently on uh, the richest Nigeria entertainer when it comes to the actress. So, and they put uh, Genevieve as the richest. And according to the statement, they say Genevieve Niger is the highest paid actress based in Africa. Netflix reportedly acquired her 2018 movie Lion Heart for 3.5 million in dollars in 2018. She was paid 95,000 pounds to star in the 2011 movie The Mirror Boy and 250, 25 dollars to star in the 2010 movie EJ The Journey. She had a 80k pounds endorsement deal with Lux in 20 in 204, 100k Range Rover endorsement deal in 2012, 82k endorsement deal in, with a tea salad in 2014, and 41k dollars deal with Polo in 2014. She also had an endorsement deal with Luna Milk, Mold Cosmetic, or more and uh, some other uh, proton beverages. Well, the thing we say, they say nine grand money pass. The richest, the highest paid actress. actress, the highest paid actress. But now, me Jenny, they know the work again. Let's be honest. Mm? Mm. Let's be honest. Now, me Jenny, they know the work again. Mm? Who do you feel by the actress that entertainment? Didn't even know they walk off. For mm -hmm. lying, let me just help you. For mm -hmm. lying, I believe uh, these people, these Yoruba actress like Funke Akinile, Tony Abraham, who are making their own movies and uh, they make money. Like this uh, movie I watched for the first time, I went to cinema. For the very first time in my life, I went to cinema and I watched. Uh, uh, Tribe of Judah. I don't usually like watching Nigerian films. Mm -hmm. I watched Tribe of Judah, and honestly, that movie was great. And so far, so good. For more than two weeks, that movie has made one billion naira. In two weeks, oh, in two weeks in Nigeria. Interesting. In two weeks in Nigeria, one billion naira. And most definitely, that movie will still go up. That movie goes to go past that one. That money. So what I'm saying is that 
we have actresses who are who owns their own company now who are doing their own individual stuff so i do not think eh, that list of Geneva Niger being the highest paid there is still feasible to me i would say it's still feasible in the sense that yeah, she's not the act again eh? i think she's still at once in the world for well, yeah, which movie she did that for a very long yeah, time now she hasn't had it. and again they are making it seems like mm. nobody has ever been paid as much as her before when okay. we get those people who are releasing their own movies they get their own movie production companies they are their production manager not the those people you are mentioning now they focus mm. they are production manager and they mm. have their own studio and the rest mm. so it's not that this one we are from what you read talking of the highest paid so we haven't heard of any of them maybe equivalent to happy for time being so then they produce they don't know how much they're making production but that's a different case mm. yeah, it's a different case and then if you to say she was one of my favorite actresses then when i was following off your movies too sorry because it's mine <laughs> <laughs> so she, she, she why is this fine they talk about that you want to stop <laughs> You want to start? She's the ISP. No doubt, no doubt. She deserves it. Uh, she wanted to say she's a good address. Okay, Jennifer, you have a fan here. Who thinks you are the best? Uh, who thinks you worth it? Who is still supporting you despite not releasing this uh, any, any movie? Well, uh, thank you guys for watching. It's your boy, Adam Slink, and uh, your boy.